what's up everyone welcome to the second video in this series you might have seen my first video on introduction to bootstrap in that video I have given a quick introduction a quick introduction on bootstrap so in this video I'm gonna show you how you can create a responsive buttons with bootstrap so we have different types and different kinds of buttons in bootstrap so let's get started and create some different kinds of buttons in our web application this is the ASP.NET Core web application and in this I'm gonna show you how you can create different types of buttons you can see here in the Jumbotron we have one container in that one we have row so in that row we have different anchor tags as well so these are some anchor tags this is the default button and this is the info button information it gives basically it gives information this is the primary button this is the success button danger and warning these are some different kinds of buttons and we have some different size of buttons as well sizes of buttons are also different in bootstrap this you can see here LG for large devices which has a screen resolution more than 1280 pixels this is extra small it has screen resolution less than 364 pixels this is SM for small devices less than 780 pix uh, less than um, 568 pixels and MD for 768 pixels resolution devices this is for the medium devices you can see here and I'm gonna take another anchor tag and create a button for success mm, that to with the block it takes the entire block size so let's save this application and run this application and see how the button will look like on our web page So these are some different kinds of buttons and these are different sizes of buttons let's run this in our home controller we have buttons page you can see here I haven't give the name of buttons this is the default this is the info button and this one is primary this one is success and this one is the danger button and this is the warning button you can see here I am creating this buttons with different sizes that first one is for large devices and this is for extra small let's copy and paste it here small and this is for the medium devices and last one is for the block block button it takes the entire block size save this and let's refresh the browser you can see here the first one is the default button and the second one is the information button third one is the primary and fourth is success fifth one is danger and the last one is warning and these are some different kinds of buttons and in the second row we can see the different sizes of buttons this is for the large this is for the large devices this is for extra small devices and this is for the medium de uh, small devices and the last one is for the medium devices and as you can see here this button is taking the entire block size because we have given a button block 
it takes the entire block size width so I think that's all about the buttons with in bootstrap and hopefully you, you like this video and subscribe to my channel on YouTube my channel name is epicop thanks for watching this video see you in the next video